After years of fighting the Skytech Megacorp faction, Leviathan has now found his home in this very faction. In this video, we will go over everything you need to know about the changes that have been made to Leviathan. Towards the end, I will also give my thoughts on these changes. And without wasting any time, let's get straight into the video. For those who may not be aware, Leviathan has previously been a part of the Renegades faction. This is the faction that consists of heroes like Dragoon, Ani, Mirage, Ghost, and Stalker. The change of faction has led to certain high-tech adjustments being made to this hero, as we will see shortly. Looking at how this hero has been reworked, his base health has been reduced from 325 to 280. The base armor has been increased from 325 to 450. Maximum turret charges have been reduced from 5 to 3. The duration of the turret has been reduced from 20 seconds to 15 seconds. The turret cooldown has been increased from 5 seconds to 8 seconds. In terms of shields, the turrets now have a shield with a maximum durability of 28 and this shield lasts for as long as the turret. A direct hit from a rocket can destroy this shield, but the turret will remain standing if it has any HP left. The skins of Leviathan have also been adjusted in terms of their colors as shown on your screen right now. But before we wrap this episode up, I would like to give my opinion on this change. I think this is a welcome adjustment to Leviathan. I will have to do some testing of course to fully experience the differences between this new version of Leviathan and the old version. What do you think about this change? Let us know below in the comment section. And if you found any value in this video, here is a few other videos you might like.